Hey, what's up guys, and welcome to another episode of Treecraft. This is episode two, and we are out of that cave. Finally, I have not died anymore. And as you can see, we have some lovely iron cooking in the furnace over here. We've got some iron ingotes. And we're just gonna wait for those to get all smelted up. And then we're gonna make some tools. We're gonna make some armor. I have to say, it's pretty good for the second episode. I went off camera a little bit and did a little bit of extra mining. I uh, got all the extra stuff. But you know, you know, you know, the casual, the casual stuff. Uh, wait, wrong thing. Okay. Okay, okay. I see how it is. Okay, so better pickaxe, better sword. In fact, let's even put this. I'm gonna actually sort out my inventory a little bit. Uh, okay. Let's have that. In fact, let's even make a... Because I think we got enough. Let's see. We have nine. Wait, let's actually wait. Although I think... I don't know. I'm just going to wait. So I will see you guys once we have everything all smelted up. Okay, guys. We are back. And I never should have hesitated that I would not have enough. Because we have a lot. And also, I realized that when I died from that creeper, I and also possibly from that zombie, I think that I lost all of my food so I went and I got a little bit just to tie me over if I need it and uh, let's just make this armor so let's see we got the chest plate got the pants okay got the boots now and then we need a hat yes I say pants and hat a lot okay and then we still have seven left over which is pretty good and now that we have all of our armor I think it's time to go find a place to make a base I think it's just about time and we're going to be doing quite a bit of sprinting for this, so I'm going to be looking for pigs along the way. And I think that rabbits give you meat, but I don't want to risk it just because they're so cute. Um, actually, it's time to eat now already. <laughs> okay, let's see. There's some sugar cane over there. Ooh, look, flower. I like flowers. That's why I'm going to break all of them. <laughs> okay, so... There's some nice rabbits. That looks like a cool area. It looks like a flower biome of some sort. Uh, actually, I'm just going to grab up some of this sugar cane just so I can have it. And I'm going to grab all of it. Why not? That lag. Okay, so we got some nice flowers here. It'd be kind of cool to collect some of these. Although it's probably going to trash up my entire inventory. This is kind of a nice place, but I, I'm not exactly sure I want to build here, though. I like building in big mountain biomes, you know? Like, where I can build on a big sheer cliff. And excuse me for dawdling and picking up flowers. I like them very much, though. This is a nice little grove. There is here. Okay, so... Uh, the question is, do I want to venture too far away from spawn? Hmm. Oh, look, pig. Yes, I need you, pig. I need your beautiful flesh. <gasps> okay, so, pig. Meat acquired. Um, there's some, like, little hills around here, but there aren't, like, any good ones. Just keep swimming, just keep swimming. In fact, I might even just build like an above ground house. I don't know. <clears throat> and if we don't get around to starting the foundation of a house at some point, uh, then, you know, you guys can defi definitely tell me in the comment section. Uh, hmm. I'm not seeing anything good. I'll, s I'll come back to you guys once I actually find something good. Okay, I'll see you guys in just a un momento. Oh my gosh, they're dogs! Hello, dogs, I pressed the wrong thing. <gasps> I have bones. Guys, we might get a dog. Doggy, come here. <gasps> we got a dog! Oh my god, I'm going to screenshot this. <laughs> yes, we have a dog. We have to come up with a name for you. You guys should tell me in the comment section what you, what you should, um, but we should name the dog. And also I found this nice little forest. Therefore, that's why we found the dog and That looks like a nice area. It's not too far away from where we just were, but... Ooh. And I also see some pigs. 
but it looks kind of, you know, small. I don't know. I don't know if you build above ground or in a mountain. I usually do in a mountain. I always thought that they're, you know, a little easier because you can just, like, carve into stuff instead of having to actually get everything to make a foundation. So... That'll be a question I'll have to figure out either during this episode or later today once you guys have seen the video. <gasps> yes, over there. This looks... This is beautiful! Oh my gosh! This is awesome! We're gonna build right there, people. See that? See that right there? Also, I wish I knew how to zoom in. I'm not exactly sure how you do that. So if any of you guys could tell me, I would be very, very appreciative. Wow, I actually like this. It's kind of small, but it's really cute. Hmm, I keep pressing that. I'm used to playing Terraria sometimes. It's like, ugh. Okay, so I have two variants of wood here, and also I need places to empty out my inventory. Um, right now, I don't think we're gonna have, like, a bridge. I think we're just gonna keep it like this for now. But I think I'm gonna go get some stone. And I love the little field that you can view out on. And my dog is so cute. I don't know what we're going to name him. Also, I need to cook up some pork chops. Whoa. So, you know, just a little bit dangerous. <laughs> oh my god. I'm done with this place. Get away from me. There we go. Um... Okay, so I think I might need a little bit more. Hmm. I love this little waterfall. Hmm. And look at that mountain, too. This is such a nice area. I think for right now we're just going to parkour our way up, but I think we're going to have the entrance right here. I like it right here. So I'm just going to meet back up with you guys when we have a nice little room going with all of our stuff in it. So I will see you guys in just a second. <coughs> Excuse me. So anyways, guys, we are back. And I have dug out a little room. And when I came to this, I realized that we do not have that much space to expand outwards. So what I'm thinking is making maybe like a spiral staircase down somewhere. And with this, I was playing. I was thinking, how cool would it be to have like a glass dome, sort of protecting this area, so we could see out through this little canyon and be able to see all this beautiful stuff. And also in this normal mode, I'm not seeing that many mobs, so I'm considering maybe maybe taking it into hard mode. But for right now, I think that we're fine. So yeah, and also all these beautiful tulips. And yeah, um, I also put all of my stuff in some chests over here. And I have some stone smelting. And also with this uh, polished diorite, I was thinking that it would look really cool as kind of like the border for the dome. And uh, yeah, I thought that would be really neat. And I know it's not like a, like a perfect circle, it's more like an egg shape, but I kind of like it. And I was thinking that for the floor, uh, we could maybe do, like, polished granite, or maybe even make it polished diorite, too, and just have it so it kind of goes up the wall. And then just have the rest of the walls stone. As you can see, I dug into this a little bit to get some diorite, and also a little bit of granite, just in case you know. But, uh, yeah. And also I made a shovel to do some landscaping. So today, I am planning on getting some sand, which is actually awesome, because there's a little sand deposit here. Now, I don't really want to destroy too much of it, so I don't know. I do not know. But anyways, guys, I think that we are going to wrap up the episode right there. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and make sure to leave a like, comment, subscription, all that good stuff. And make sure to give me some tips on things if you think I'm a little noobish. I admit I may be a little noobish. But anyways, guys, thank you and goodbye.